Hey guys, welcome back to Factorio. This is Eddie Man, episode number 95. Last episode, we went ahead and covered our one last iron fix. As you can see here, we went ahead and captured this um, little post here. Well, I guess it's part of the base now because it's in range of the wall. Um, we've gone ahead and we put this uh, mining uh, post here and off camera went ahead and extended it to this mi minefield here uh, for backup iron ore uh, so that should give us plenty of ore now at least for this pickup station here um, I do have some more to the west that once I get out there over here I'm sorry I will go ahead and mine this patch and this patch as well uh, but again uh, I'm not gonna cover iron or fixes anymore uh, I have a train that's out of coal here and it's and it's jamming up the whole train network okay let's go fix that right now first and foremost uh, like I mentioned last episode today we're gonna go ahead and work on some iron um, not iron, I'm sorry. Some oil, um, last minute oil things. Um, again, this is going to act as the last oil fix uh, for this series. I know it's uh, this series is finally coming down to the, the nitty gritty here. And um, I got a little special surprise for you guys in store. Um, so stay tuned for that. It's going to be really exciting. Um, I cannot wait. <laughs> um, over here. That's right. As of recording, um, tomorrow is uh, going to be April um, 25th. And that's going to be opening night for Avengers Endgame. Uh, so I'm super stoked about that. If you guys are interested in that, um, just jot down in the comments that you know your ideas on that and your excitement. Uh, pertaining to that movie uh, I c cannot wait <laughs> um, and then um, that leads into the weekend and um, hopefully everything plays out and uh, I'll be able to um, record a little bit more of this series and possibly wrap it up this weekend um, that's all the details I'm going to say on that so very exciting super stoked about that so stay tuned like i said oh um that means that we have a damaged wall they destroyed a turret out there okay we'll have to go fix that all right so i fixed the train let's go back to the oil um i want to divert some of the plastics so what we're going to go ahead and do is back here. We are going to create another one of these oil of uh, plastic built here. And we're going to do it strictly for rocket um, development down here, a rocket factory. So we're going to go ahead and stamp another one right here. And conveniently enough, we have oil here, which seems to be backed up. Hmm. Oh, um, petroleum gas is backed up here. And there's no light or heavy oil in sight. Because we are not producing anything else because petroleum gas is full. And these are all, yep. These are all full here. Should I be limiting these? Um, yeah, we'll leave it like that. So yeah, let's go ahead and start this. First thing we need to do is we need to grab uh, some coal here. Did I upgrade this to red belt? Yes, I did. Okay, so we're going to use the red belt then. Not a problem. We're just going to sneak 
the coal through here for now. All the way through. Whoops. You know, that didn't look right. Okay. Um, I was going to say this is no longer needed, but I guess we can just spaghetti the call through here. Yep, and then we can plant down here because if conveniently enough I have petroleum gas right here okay uh, let's go ahead and build that post here for coal Right. Get rid of these trees. We're finally gonna tap into this coal here. I've been saying it for eons. It feels like, <laughs> believe it or not. Well, let's just get rid of all these trees here. Okay. I'm not even sure how long this is gonna last, and. Honestly, it's just going to be me meant for um, blasting some rockets off. To really be honest with you. <clears throat> okay. Uh, so we need this. Hmm. Technically, we can act it we can utilize this to stock the train up conveniently enough okay why me thinks it's gonna be like this okay Okay, we are going to run into a little bit of issues here. It looks like we're going to need some landfill. Okay, can I get away with just three pieces here? Let's shrink that down to one piece here. I doubt it. Nope, we need, we need another piece there. Okay, gonna need some more stone ore, which is right here. Oh, <laughs> bingo, never mind. Just make some of that. We're gonna have to make some landfill. Um, I will come back to that a little later though. A little later. Okay. Can we put the belt here now? Perfect. I'll turn off these this way. Oops, sorry about that guys. Uh, can we squeeze? Err. Um. There we go. Bingo. Okay. 
So I get two yellow belts of. There we go. One belt of. One red belt of. Of coal here. Excellent. Oh, look how lined up that is. Perfect. It's like it was meant to be. Let's go like this here, shall we? Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. Over here, shoot. We are all lit up here. Let's just get rid of some of this foliage here. If I need to run around, I can make it a little bit more nice there. Okay. All right. So the coal here is going to. Oh. Okay. Just gonna sneak this right through here like a boss. Yep, and I'm out of red belt. Let's just go grab some conveniently enough right here. Oh, the heck with it. Just grab the rest of it, right? go the coal coming down here now towards the main bus past the main bus to a lovely plastic belt now I think I have it in my blueprint book here yes I do look at that excellent Um, where is the petroleum gas coming in? I think it's right here. The outer belt is the, the outer belt is the coal. And the inner belt will be the plastics. Now, why is the plastic on a splitter here? It's not. Why do I have a splitter though? It doesn't have to be. Okay. Alright. So maybe. We can do something like this. Let's 
Just give it plenty of room, right? Why not? Why not? So if we do this, there's room for the coal to come through. Uh, and then there's room for the petroleum gas to come in also. Okay, I like that. Uh, let's just plant that down and see if that lines up with this here. So this is the aisle here that this is gonna come up. Ooh. I think I wanted it a little bit more to the west. Okay, that's the coal. I don't need that. <clears throat> And then I want to do this. I want to change this. Can't do that. Dang damn it. Because of this. Alright, I can't change that. I wish I could flip this over. Because then if it comes out here, right, which means it would come out here, this one here, it passes, oh wait, look at that, that's, how convenient is that, it would come up this way, right? And it would line up with this. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's fix that then. We are going to flip this around. So that means... None of this, none of that. None of this either. All right. I'm going to come down here like so. Nope. We are going to do this. Right, and then we're gonna do that. Oops. Sorry guys, fl flashing the screen like that. I'm just trying to get this. Well, instead of making the ghost, let's just make the real belts here. Now, I don't think I need to change any of these. Nope, I don't. Okay, and then this is the coal coming in. Okay, let's just build that so we know where that is. Let's do 
that. Okay. And then the call would come up to you. And then how does that look there? Two spaces skip. Okay. And then this is the plastic coming in here. Once it's produced, that is. Okay, and then I need some chemical plants. Do I have any in my inventory? No. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I need ten of them. Can I make ten of them? Yep, I can. So we'll just handcraft them, that's fine. Okay, and then we're gonna do the red inserters first. Which is bringing the coal in. And then the blue inserter is going to be taking the plastic out. Okay, got the power poles in. Let's do the chemical plants. have the recipes. Well, let's connect. Let's connect to power, shall we? Oh, it would have been nice if I just lined it up where this was here, right? I don't think I can put it there. Because of the No worries. We can just do that. That's fine. The last chemical plants here. All right. some pipes don't know how many we're gonna need oh, voila we got plastics being made look at that oh yeah yeah boy Technically, we can cut this down here out. But let's change this to uh, output priority is going to be right. Okay, let's see if that works. And then don't like how that looks. Let's go ahead and just swiggle it this way. And then we'll put a splitter in there. Right. Okay, so we got more plastics being made now. Perfect. 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 Alright. I do want to do a couple more things before I wrap up this episode. 
Obviously, we only did one thing so far. I want to double this up here. Okay. Um, can I get by with this? Yes, I can. Okay. Um, we got that. The only problem is we have... Oh, that's right here. Batteries. Uh, we're going to be making laser turrets there. And then we need this here. <clears throat> we're going to put power pole there. How did we want to do this? Alright. Let's change it to you. Let's do this to that. This to that. I'm um, we'll change it to two stacks. All right, All right. we double up on that. Um, let me take those. Let me just stack up on those. Okay. <clears throat> so batteries looks good. Uh, accumulator and solar panel production looks fine. Uh, what do we need for the satellite? Uh, the rocket, the rocket does not require a satellite anymore. Now the satellite is—is is it its own research now? I don't even see the satellite here. Oh, here it is. Okay. Low density short. It's still the same recipe. Okay, okay. Just was just checking there. Okay. We just need to make sure that I still got coal here too. <laughs> Alright. Everything here looks good. Perfect. Uh Explosives. All this rest of this oil looks good here. Um, I want this plastic here to go mostly to advanced circuits here now. Which looks pretty. Everything here looks good. Okay. Alright. Um, I did mention I wanted to make a third one of these here. We'll go ahead and do that a little later on. Uh, I'm going to make a list of things to do for the next episode. Uh, so next episode is going to be like a miscellaneous type of uh, projects coming together type of episode. Miscellaneous or something. I haven't come up with a name for it yet, but I will. Um, but right now I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this episode. It looks like all the oil... Um, Facilities look good. Um, I'm not going to sp spend any more time on camera worrying about oil. Um, if I do come up with any issues, I'll go ahead and rectify them off camera again. Like I said about um, iron ore and copper ore. Um, another thing I want to get to is making a little area for um, landfill production. Uh, I might just do that up here someplace. Um, because we're going to need some landfill for our end game project. Did that train run out again? Yeah, what is up with this train? 
Again, let's go ahead and check this train out before I let you guys go here. Empty cargo or five seconds of inactivity. Iron Main. Um, so we want empty cargo inventory or time passed 30 seconds. Fuel. Okay. Luckily, we're not using iron ore right now, but we are backing up the whole shebang here. Oh, I'm going to take these because I have a plan for those. But thank you guys so much for joining me in this episode of Factorio. I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this one here. Mission Critical Point 17 Oil Check, episode number 95. Um, I've been having so much fun wrapping up this series. I, I hate to see the series go, but you got to sometimes just let go of an old friend and let it go and move on to bigger and better things is what I have planned for um, me playing Factorio and the um, direction I want to bring, you know, I want to do for my channel. Uh, so stay tuned for all the exciting stuff. Um, over the next couple of months or so, leading into the summertime, I do have a lot of plans in store. So, again, stay tuned for that. But right now, thank you guys so much for joining me in this episode of Factorio. And like always, I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.